Well, hello and welcome to a rather bountiful mailbag here on Hubnut. Uh, we've got a different microphone solution this time. We're not using a <laughs> CV aerial. Um, we haven't got two mics because I wanted two mics. Yes, yes stop, stop waving the dangly thing. And uh, yeah, thank you. Uh, well, we might as well jump in. Where, where should I start, madam? I think we should probably start on sensible things. Sensible things. And there are lots of lovely sensible things. Is that actually? the letter that goes with that? Yes. Okay. And do you want to explain you stole the box? Yeah, I did steal the box. So I'll, I'll allow you to demonstrate while I tackle the letter. But this, this did arrive in a lovely box all the way from Canada. Ontario, in, in fact. And uh, yeah, we had to nick the box to send we? some merchandise. There was no win. I had to nick the box <laughs> to send some merchandise. So thank you very much. It was a very useful box. Uh, this is from Malcolm Early, uh, who owns a Daimler SP250 or Dart. Uh, yeah, I, I like those very much. He's a, a Brit living in Canada. Okay, so, so I'm writing to enclose two insulated cups. Slightly hubnut on the two cups. You took one. One of them is not here. Um, but a little bird tells me noon is a tad chilly. It's not so bad today. Uh, I'm a Brit, well, Geordie, why a man, living in Canada it's since 2012, and now and again morning. the temperature drops a little like minus 35. Let's just say. Oh necessitating something to keep my tetleys warm so these cups from from my company's merchandise store should we have a look then yes i was i was doing the tea stays love. warm if not hot for a considerable amount of time i do hope both your and miss hubbard's cockles are warm well thank you very much Martha. i was doing a very i was doing the glamorous sort of wheel of fortune yeah, that's very nice. what's on it I lovely doing... skyjack skyjack simply, simply reliable. reliable they're very smart just guys. like hubner not not no. like hubner no Hi Hubnut, I really enjoy your channel and when I saw your video on the Primera I thought you might like this to go on your keys. I don't have a key ring for it. I used to have an SX with the same engine but with heated leather seats and electric everything. Ah. So an SX has more kit than an SLX. It makes no sense um, Nissan. Keep up the good work and stay safe from James Wilkinson in Plymouth. Oh, thank Lovely, you. Lovely, isn't it? And it matches the key rings I've got. Well, you've got one for Shemmy, Shemmy which is yeah. very nice. And I've got one for Myrtle. Myrtle. Yeah, so, lovely. Thank you very much. Thank that you very much. Lovely. Uh, this is to the hub nuts. I think I'll hold the envelope. Mr. and Mrs. Mr. Yeah. and Mrs. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, Miss Hubnut. Oh, vicious. Dear hub nuts, shall we say, watch your mailbox videos. Please could you pass on to your viewers in march 2021 but it will be autism awareness week between the 29th of march to the 4th of april uh, well that, that's not all that far away because you'll be seeing this video in march uh, my first job was at a land rover dealership so i've changed quite a few light bulbs in my time driving on the open road to me cars mean independence yes definitely and a way to access a better life well they did until lockdown this is from christoph and his 450 pound mitsubishi and he says trains are good too, which you would agree with. Yeah, but the trains to me generally mean I'm off to get a car. <laughs> Rather oh, fabulous wow. drawing. Is, uh, yeah. That is brilliant. Autism Awareness Week, a lovely photo of a Land Rover on mounting rescue duty. By the look of it, helicopter in the background. That's very nice. That's so okay. yeah. So Autism yeah, 29th definitely... of March, was that? Yeah, and, and, and I think that will probably resonate. Um, uh, I, I think quite a few um people i know are on the spectrum and it, it does make life difficult because a lot of people just aren't very understanding of no. what autism is and how you can have such a vast range um of spectrum yes. should we say so Absolutely. some some people very high functioning some less so so yeah good, good to be aware of and uh, uh oh this is from wait ian wait 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 you have to hope this, this is relevant appeals to you this is ian edwards um, down in south wales I've known him many years. Uh, oh. <laughs> wow, well, this is for peelengineering.co.uk. It's a brochure for the world's smallest car. I think we know someone who will enjoy that. I think we do. Yeah. We still have a cake one in our house. Mm. Oh, well, it's the original one from when they were on Dragon's Den. Okay. Wow. There we go. And there's one at Ripley's, which I didn't know. Yeah, they, I think they have one in every one of their Ripley stores. The kids are big into Ripley, so mm. we shall have Where to go are and they? see. New York, London and Niagara Falls. 
I wouldn't want to go over Niagara Falls in a peeled P50. I wouldn't fancy your chances, to be no. honest. Uh, this has come from uh, ah Martin Neumann in uh, Ravensburg, Martin Germany. doing a massive catch-up, bless him. Oh. <laughs> Oh, wow, we've got loads of postcards yes. here. Yes, you've got to start at one, which you is the one, one. Right, okay. on. Uh Yeah, I might not read all these out, because this could take a while. Uh, you said something about Mavic. I did think, postcards! Oh, no, he, <laughs> he, he, he yes, he's catching up because he's missed a few. So, there is Martin in his Hubnut beanie. Lovely uh, beanie. With his Citroen C1. C1. Mm -hmm. What do you think? It is, yes. They're the, the superior of the three. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Miss Hubnut prefers the Peugeot. I want the Peugeot. One no, the no, the Citroen's the best one. Oh, oh no, blimey. that's a Mitsubishi Pajero um, in the snow. Oh, very nice. Uh, taken a few weeks ago, yeah. Uh, ooh. <laughs> oh, very nice. Oh, ooh. sorry, it's you vibrating. Uh, Rover 2.5 litre V6. That looks like a very early one. It's got the black seals by the look of it. That's a lovely colour. Colour is lovely, yeah. Yeah, so we like that one. It's in good condition, road legal, but I never see it moving. <laughs> and then we've got a charade on steely wheels, uh, or rather a quarry, uh, because that was the name they used in Europe. Quarry being the Italian for love, is it? Or heart? One of the two. Italians will correct me. Uh, thank you for all your videos. Well, thank you, Martin. We, we certainly missed the um, postcard, so thank we you for do. the catch-up. We do. Let's look at have a catch-up. Thank you. Oh, and that's his envelope. Oh, yes. Oh, stamps. Whoever we're collecting the stamps for, we are still collecting them. We haven't forgotten about you. Yes, <laughs> someone did message me to say they would like the stamps. So, um, I'm sure that's someone can and, make uh, I think, yeah, yeah, you have a read of that letter before you get excited, young man. Okay. I'll go to you. Goes <laughs> to you. Oh, maybe you should read this. <laughs> You don't look like a fridge magnet person, so these are made for Miss Hubnut by Gary M. Well, you certainly have a fridge covered in magnets. <laughs> I do. I do love fridge magnets. I buy them wherever we, whenever we go somewhere. So, we've got the lovely Took and the lovely Ellie. Yeah. Amusingly, um, these were probably sent before we released our own magnets, which are on my toolbox up here. Um, Thank but, you very But they're much. very nice. I like those very They will much. be going directly on our fridge. Directly on the fridge. The poor yes. fridge door is just going to collapse. It's just going to fall off. <laughs> uh, Sheila Davis. Oh, Planny Lois. This will have come from my, my yes. friend Graham. Then. That, um, that, that's your lot, mate. Oh, that's it. It's all right. <laughs> uh, now you're getting more modern cards, you may be able to use this. Plus your key. Oh, yes, there it is. <laughs> my key. Thank you, Graham. Graham was the key holder at the previous unit, just so we could keep an eye on the place. Uh, let me to read us in because even though I didn't have electricity next doors came through so thank you very much Graham um, that was very good of you and uh, a code reader as well which mm -hmm. might actually work on your car oh we'll have to give it a try yeah so thank you Graham maybe we'll keep that one in Shemmy oh that's a good idea yeah so that'd be a good idea because your keeping things in car technique works so well yes I, I guess Graham feels he doesn't need that for his MG midget oh who's this from Mr. Terry Dixon, is that the old pensioner? I believe so. Ah, thank you, old pensioner. Uh, I don't a... think he's the old pensioner, I think he's a pensioner. Oh, is he just the pensioner? <laughs> sorry, sorry, Terry, I'm misremembering. Um, but yeah, thank you very much. Uh, I know he was very, very concerned that a certain person had lost his multimeter. Yes. And we hadn't come across it in the uh, tidying and so far. We need that because Myrtle's still got her drain. Can that yeah. help us find it? Hopefully it can. So thank you very much, Terry. Uh, so from Alan Wicker, not that one I'm guessing. Do a bag removal. Ooh, no. this would have been helpful with the um, heat <laughs> resistor. But thank you very much, Alan. Uh, he did say he was going to send that through. So that is a Haynes manual for the Primera. So it does not cover the diesel engine or new Primera range if you use. I like, look, it's got new um, in speech marks because it was just a facelift. Really. Ah. Mm. Uh, that should be very interesting. Hopefully, we won't need it. But Those this is sound Hubnut, like famous so last words me. You can pop it will. on our stack. Yeah. Thank you very much. That will go straight on the stack there. Beautiful. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> oh, I think I'm going to like this. Yes. Bedford commercial vehicles. Oh, yes. I'm definitely going to like it. Oh, I love wow. Bedfords. Um, I, I love the, um, the TKs. I think it's a very attractive cab. Not a tipper cab though. So that makes life interesting. Uh, the CFs, wonderful vans. I like them very much. I used to own one, and they got the HA 
or the Bedford Beagle um, in um, sort of estate car form. Oh wow, it falls out in one away. Ooh, life cover detail to look through this at some point. Uh, I should probably contemplate the letter instead of um, getting too drawn into that. Oh, he's got a separate one for the Bedford <laughs> CF range. I'll probably read the Yo letter, he says, getting drawn into the next one. Yeah. Uh, good morning or afternoon. I think it's still morning. I have literally no yeah, idea. The children are awake, so it's screwing with my weekend timings. Uh, I thought you might like to add these brochures to your collection. All the best to you and your family. And that's from Dan. So, thank you very much, Dan. I'm definitely going to enjoy that one. I do need to do more videos where I just look through these. I need to find a better way of filming them. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. You no. say, you're saying it's rubbish. Yes, we do need to do more of these, not oh. yes, you're rubbish. Oh. <laughs> You sure? I don't think I think you're wonderful. I don't think what we got it. here. Oh, an LED headlamp. No, no. Oh, okay. Uh, a gift note from Alexander Stevenson Catch. Uh, oh, from Eddie. Uh, I guess Eddie hasn't got his own Amazon account. Headlights for curious nutlets. Much light for the underside of the fleet. And a helicopter. For Miss Hubnut to get some oh, more footage on nice days. Ah, so they're for the, the Hublets. Oh, gosh. Okay. That'd be useful. They'd be very useful. When we, when we send them out dog walking at night. <laughs> wow, thank you very much. They look like they'll be very bright. Got, haven't got the batteries in. The batteries are supplied. But that would be very useful. Thank you. Thank you, Eddie. Thank you. I'm um, slightly curious about the yeah. helicopter. We don't seem to have a helicopter, but um, thank you for that, Eddie. That's Those are brilliant. Thank yeah. you very much. There's another set of seat covers. There's a letter in there, my love. Shall I read that while yeah, you I ponder that? I don't need to open it because the letter is exposed. I thought these might come in handy for Miss Hubner and Shemina Sherard. Still do with your vehicles. Keep up the good work from Nan Jack. Nan Jack has definitely been buying things through the store, so thank you, Nan. Thank you very much. But Shemi is very much in need of seat covers, bless her. Um, her front seat is. Um, yeah, I think, we, I, think, I think we now have two sets though. But, That's um, okay. Myrtle's seats aren't we in have... the best of shape. She's also blue. So. Going... We have children and dogs. Oh. These might not be side airbag compatible. I need to. Um, Whereas the other ones definitely are. On we check that. Shemi. Yeah. But uh, time is something I don't really have at the moment. After Easter, it's going to be marked. Oh, we'll have loads be of it. We'll have loads so of it. So, thank you, Nan. They will find their way into a vehicle of some sort. Shemmy's already got seat covers. They were sent by another kindly person of the internet. Oh, wow. Well. Uh, apparently, it's the season. Any note with this one? No, I couldn't no, find it. Just come from one. Amazon. It's another multimeter. Oh, this one looks quite fancy. It's got buttons. Mm. So thank you very much. What sort of prongs has it got? Prongs make all the difference. Oh, it's just got the pointy prongs. Um, it's also got a temperature probe and a multifunction socket. I have no idea what that does. We, we should find out. I think there are instructions. Perhaps you could read them. Yes, I am the reader of instructions. Two multimeters. In this household. <laughs> By the way, uh, we are going to have um, some clear out. I, I need to get rid of some stuff because I have much stuff. I think um, any duplicates we feel we don't need that have been very kindly sent by you. Um, I think we'll I'm just going to say this is now on social media. We yeah. heard that, yes? Yeah. Clear out. Yeah, clear out. I'm actually going to have a clear out. But yeah, if, 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 if it's my stuff, then um, I, I might um, keep some of that money to put towards the channel. But if it's stuff like this where it's a duplicate, we will do stuff um, for charity. Uh, yes. I think we could Absolutely. raise quite a bit. I think so. So uh, that, that's something we're trying to do. I've got a vague idea. I probably haven't even told you this yet. I'm <laughs> trying, to, trying to do a few Hubnet socials around the country no, later. No, you did tell you. me that. I did tell you that. Yes, you did. You said, I've got this amazing idea and it might work or it might be totally rubbish. Yes. That was your word. And that is to have a quick tour in the UK and visit people and um, hopefully hold a few socials. Yes. So we'll yeah. see if we can make that happen later in the year. And if we do, we might well have a big box of stuff. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> One box. Several boxes. <laughs> we might well have a delivery lorry full of stuff. Market stall full yeah. of stuff. Do we need a van? I think we probably do need a van. Wait, no, I know where you're going with that. The ones you've seen on Marketplace. No, no. no. 
That Ooh, transit camper. That familial. Oh, CX familial. That you get a lot of stuff in one of those. Yes, you would. Yes, you would. I can yeah. say from personal experience. Yes, you would. But aren't, aren't ten cars enough, really? You don't think so. No, it's true. Are we going to start on the wish? Yes. Right. We've got. We, we. I haven't been through these, but Miss Hubner assures me that this is at least slightly family friendly. We're going to be all right. Yes. Yes. There is one item which I might grab from you at the time. Okay. <laughs> this will be fun then. Am I starting here? Start wherever you like with this lot. Okay. Let's see what we've got in this bag. So, for those who don't know, Wish is is renting in there. No. Wish is a company. It's kind of like eBay. So sellers use it as a platform. Um, you can buy stuff on there. But I think um, someone at Wish or someone in China certainly has got my PO box address and just like sending random stuff. Oh, this is very random. <laughs> it's another multimeter. <laughs> oh, that was like a perfect little dinky travel multimeter. I'm going to have great fun comparing the multimeters. Oh, yes. We'll see if they all read the same voltage on various things. So, there you're we go. actually going to do that. That's the thing. Yeah. Like, you say this, and you're actually going to do it. Okay, keep that one. And what goes with a multimeter well? <laughs> a little plastic pot. This said snow shovel. Snow shovel. By all means, work that one out. No sound of a. It does say snow shovel times one. Uh, worth eight pounds eighty. What even is that? I mean, you're not going to put liquid in, so it's going to be, it's going to fall over. Or does that come off? Oh. Ah, and then you can put it on there and any stuff, residue, oh, so will be caught. So funnel? it is a funnel. It's not a snow shovel at all. There we go, that's quite interesting. Uh, what have we got in here? Outdoor fleece hood. Oh yeah, no, that was okay. I'm quite taken with that one. Oh yeah. For warm, I think that'd be brilliant. Now let's put it over. Does that work? Oh yes. I'm an old style guru. That is definitely unit Smells chic. Smells very interesting. Unit chic. Yeah, thank you. So that actually was what it said on the packaging. That's unusual for items sent from Wish. Uh, this one is glass. Worth one pound sixty-seven. Oh, glass is. Oh. Uh, it says yellow night vision glasses. Night vision glasses? Okay, it's a shame it's daytime. They do make the world look very yellow. The problem is uh, we both wear glasses. <laughs> so um, they're sadly not going to be very useful. Uh, the build quality on those is spectacularly shod. <laughs> is this safe? Ev everything is safe. Keep going. Uh, this says polyester fiber rainbow for gay. <laughs> oh, it's a rainbow flag by the look of it. Which is great because I'm here all the time. Of course, technically it is um, polyester fiber. But... Oh, there we go. Oh, lovely. And in England, it also means NHS for some reason. So, uh, yeah, thank you very much. It's a pride flag. Yeah, I'm very proud of it. And there we go. Description of contents, clean. Now... Is it? I think so. I'm not entirely sure what we are cleaning with these. There's a lovely little smiley face on them. Yeah. And it feels like a tablet. I thought it might feel like something else. But it feels like a tablet. Okay, let's, let's have a look. I'm going to open one of them, I, I think. I knew you were going to do that. Uh, so yeah, we've got lots of um, writing. If you are Chinese, maybe you know what it says. And this is Hold on, bit. I've got Google Translate on my phone, I think. This is the bit when this video goes out that it says, do not open this. Yeah. Highly toxic. Okay. <laughs> what? I'll, I'll have to show you what's going on here. Uh, let's see if we can uh, show you. So here's Miss Hubnet looking lovely. But, uh, hello. Oh, I'm, I'm aiming wrong. Concentrated wiper fine effervescent tablet. Concentrated wiper building. Concentrated wiper precision. <laughs> so it's a fizzy tablet of some sort. I wonder if it's screen wash. Maybe. 
Yeah. That would make sense. I did mention Wi-Fi, didn't it? It did. So I uh, dare you. <laughs> I want to put it in a car. I might put it in a bottle. Oh, okay. We'll save that for later, though. Now this is the uh, upper and lower teeth. What? <laughs> it actually is teeth. And some little plastic balls. Keep your teeth dry. Yeah, they, 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 they look lovely. I'm, I'm definitely going to put those I've in my I've got to mouth. say, I have heard stories of people buying veneers on the internet and, and this is what they get, bless them. I'm slightly concerned. What, what's wrong with our teeth? I know. Got a teeth whitener. Some teeth. Mm. Uh, this is knit hat. Oh, no, not hat. <laughs> no. It's some tiny pants. <laughs> Customs, you need to check this stuff more. Look, that is blatantly not a hat. They really are tiny pants. They are tiny skin colour pants. Perfect for those who don't want to look like they're wearing pants. Hold on, we've got a label. Shi Shang Yu Ho. Shi Shang Yu Ho. That's uh, interesting there. Made in China, unsurprisingly. All right, what have we got on this one? Hook up. Wait, I oh, know you're okay with that one. Oh no, it's a it's a buffing mat. Oh, that's quite nice. Yeah, that that's not a hooker. Somebody, some things get lost in translation. I think. Screen protector. And that is what it says on the tip. Not quite sure what screen. Yeah, there you go. Screen. Yeah, what is that a screen? Who's got a screen that shape? I think there will definitely be a wish store when we come to do the socials. Yeah, we could do wish lucky dip. Oh dear God. Oh yes. yes. Actually yes. Lucky dip on wish. Yeah, we've got to do that. But maybe it would be for adults only. It might have to be. Yes. We, we, we can clean it up. We can try, control what goes in. Or yeah, does that take the fun out of it? Imminently more fun if we yeah. throw everything in there. This is described as moisturiser. And actually this one's okay. Oh. Chenced neck and face repair cream. Use it to make you graceful. Well, <laughs> I love the Chinglish. As I have destroyed my new T-shirt today, and yeah. I'm generally clumsy. Maybe I should just cover myself in that. Uh, instructions: Put the neck cream into the palm. Apply gently from the neck up and down. When the neck cream is evenly applied, it can be rubbed, heated, and lightly applied. Okay. Effect: Eliminate neck wrinkles. Restore smooth and tight neck. Improve the dryness, roughness, relaxation, and other neck problems. Remove the elastic and tender neck skin. Remove. Ooh. Multiple uses, not only for the neck. <laughs> there yeah, we go. Well, yes, it's chenched a, it's neck. A, it's for the chest and, uh, and face. face. Yeah, so rub that all over your chest. <laughs> you didn't sniff it, I thought you would sniff it. Oh, it's been sealed, let's not oh. do that. Well, this time we've got sticker. Oh, no, you're okay. <laughs> no, that's not a sticker. That is paint. Super writing distance, no, low smell. No xylene or twirline. Oil base, no transparent. Shaking the paint pen before using. Do not burn, even when empty. Crikey, okay. Inca comply with the European Union Roche Directive. Oh, that well-known Roche So directive. you've got to do shaking, you've got to do air out, and then you've got to do pressing. We're getting there, we've got a box of a box of automobile FM. Yeah, this is quite interesting. Oh, is this one oh it's one of those transmitters. Haha. -ha. So you can listen to your MP3 player in your car with an old stereo. Of course I have many cars with old yes. stereos, mostly they don't work. But uh yeah, hands free, quick charge, stream music. Don't tell the children, or they'll be streaming their music and that'll be awful. But yeah, that, that actually looks quite useful. So thank you, whoever sent that by wish. And in this one, we've got Bolt. It's not a Bolt. This is, yeah, this is quite um, what? appropriate. Surely this hasn't come from Wish. Yeah. It is a Nissan bonnet badge. Uh, that's extraordinary. 100% we're putting that on the Primera. It, oh, oh, look, it's even got pedestrian safety in mind. It's got a spring in it. So you only get mildly impaled. Um, 
Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about bonnet badges. Come on. You think that's got to go on? Yes. Okay. That may go on a Nissan at some point, but thank you. I'll, I'll just keep it on display. Okay. Myself. But uh, thank you very much, whoever sent that. That feels more personalised. Yes, there is a very strange combination. We've got the multi beta Yeah. And the Nissan badge and the wireless transmitter. There's some things in here that are very personal. And okay. I'm just taking that one. Oh, okay. We'll come back to that one. Will we reveal it on social media or something? Would that be safer? Yeah, we've got, yeah, we've we got can't do a separate video, we just started. No, we've got on. four yeah. items. Okay, these are sock. To go with the Wish t-shirt. Oh my gosh, we now have Wish socks. Wish ankle socks, by the look of it as well. The irony being that you don't see your ankle socks is rather the point that they hide in the shoe. And you might see the little Wish bit on the yeah. top. Maybe. So, yes, well done Wish. In case anybody's worried, we didn't forget this parcel which is for Mr. Diego Hubnut. Aha! We have left that one to the Hubluts. When we go home, they will be opening that one. But we did miss one of the prime wish items. So. Oh, okay. Hubnut. Other end. Other end. <laughs> oh, yeah. Night light home safety decoration. Eight colour toilet light. Fit any toilet, make your life colourful. Uh, that's uh, extraordinary. Where do you fit it on your toilet? Insert batteries, adjust the arm to the right side. Oh, you, so you'd hang it like a toilet smelly thing? Yeah. 100% that's going in the toilet. No more blinding midnight lights, stumbling in the dark, missing and making a mess or falling into open toilets that, hazard. that's a hazard that i mean for, especially hazard. for a small person for me all the time yeah. i find myself that's in train spot it happens all the time at home yeah. i have to be very careful uh the toilet light only works in the dark it will light up automatically when it detects movement and stay on for two minutes after the last movement so it's got a <laughs> movement sensor on the outside and the color bit goes inside your toilet guys you appreciate okay. this is going to be prime twitter content yeah there will be <laughs> toilet that's going to happen is it that's going to happen toilets <sighs> at night so thank you wish and uh that yeah that's quite extraordinary <laughs> so thank you everybody um uh, for another thrilling and um somewhat baffling selection of items <laughs> thank you very much for all the serious ones yes. seriously thank you very much so it's and, always uh, so thoughtful yeah and uh we shall see you in a future video i shall leave you with the eight color toilet light <laughs> oh we have one more bit of bonus mailbag because it is for Diego Hubner, who um, unfortunately Diego cannot be here today. Uh, he'd be going mad. There's a, someone browsing around on a motorbike. He'd be getting very excited. And there are many cats around today. So uh, I thought your mother had been in here, but apparently not. All right. So we are opening this for the first time. Oh, oh this could be rude. I don't think it will be. It's no. been sent for Diego. Yeah. So who wants to pull it out? Oh. Oh, my oh wow. Is it a dog? Oh my God. Dog, jump. <laughs> dog jumper oh with hub mutt on it. That's amazing. Wow. Oh, um, yes. Well, he, he, he's not the most fan of clothing. He will wear it, so we'll have to see if we can yes, get, him, get him in it. A card came with it. A card came with it. Diego and Mr. Hub Nut. And a bar. It says Hub Nut. Oh yeah, it's nice little mask. No problema. To Diego and Mr. Hubnut, we love watching your videos with our dad. We asked our mum if she could make a special gift for you both. We hope you like them. From Clive and Walter in Newcastle. And and there is Clive and Walter. So, so they sent us some gifts. So thank you very much Clive and Walter. And uh, we'll see if we can get Diego to wear his new Hubnut outfit. Bye. Bye bye. Say some things. Some things. Some things. Some things. Deeper. Some things.